Hey all, hey, um, this is Lee McCormack from Lee Likes Bikes. I am here in Massachusetts with none other than Dr. Patrick Carey. Look at that guy. Um, we're here, um, we just trained, did advanced coach training for NEYC, New England Youth Cycling. Mm -hmm. um, it, it, amazing, beautiful shit. And whenever we're here together, we talk philosophy. God's been serving me the insights lately, hot and fast, like flapjacks. We just had a nice breakfast. Let's look at your life. Your whole life, 80, 90, 100 years. When you come in, it's all about this world. All the things we do, um, work, friends, partners, all the things we do, they're massively important. And we're gonna pursue these. And we're gonna learn the lessons we, we, we need to learn. We take on these activities. Mountain biking's a good one. It's a great one. It's one of the best, because it has all the things in it. And we, and we go in, and we, so when we begin mountain biking, it's all about the mountain biking, is it not? It's like, well, how far did you go? How fast? Like, we all have different metrics. That's one thing that's cool about mountain biking. If you want to go do some crazy, long, ridiculous cross-country race like this meathead here, you know, do it. I just did some, right? But be aware of why. Be aware of why are you compelled to do these long cross-country races? Why are you compelled to be a downhill racer? Why are you compelled to do a specific jump, hop higher, whatever it is? Like, all of these inclinations we have are important and you should pursue it. But be aware of why you're doing it. Mm -hmm. Be aware of what the outcome might be and then be aware enough to know when to release that. So, for example, I was racing cross country, what, a few weeks ago, excruciating pain before I got my x rays on my shoulders. And I was like, I'm hurting myself. No more. Done. I know how to suffer on a bicycle. I'm not going to do it anymore. This trip, I haven't ridden. I've just been coaching. That guy right there does all the ballistic, terribly horrible, beautiful, scary Super things. Fun things. Super fun things. <laughs> and I'm not jealous. I am. But no, I'm not. It's just like, I can't. <laughs> I can't. And so everything I do with my shoulders from now till the surgery removes bone and reduces the chance they can fix it. If they can't fix it, I will have a nurse when I'm old to brush my teeth and wipe my butt. I don't want this. I want to be a you know, vital guy. I am, thank God, have done the personal work mm -hmm. where I don't have to be the dude who travels in, climbs the unclimbable hill, shreds the unshreddable shred, and blows your mind with a, with a, what a freaking physical badass I am. We were out the other day on the unclimbable hill. Mm -hmm. I'm cold. I'm gonna make it. I'm good at this sort of thing, am I not? That's, That's the kind of power I'm made for. Mm -hmm. My shoulder starts to hurt. Now I've seen the x ray. I know what I'm doing. I'm grinding bone off a of bone. I stop. I get out of the way, and this stud right here gets it. And you know what E pointed out? She's like, you know, you're in, when you're not in pain, you're gonna be smarter. You're gonna be more patient, you're gonna be more creative. And I was like, whoa, because she asked me, how do you feel this week? And I'm like, I feel actually good. Why? I'm not riding. I'm not smashing rocks with Patrick. And I did some good coaching, didn't I? It was great. Like we did some of the most transcendent coaching we've ever done. We learned so much together. We did, we always do, but this was different. So maybe because I wasn't in pain. What's happened by pure accident is that as I lose the ability to do these things, my personal development has made it so I don't have to do those things. This hit me. I was like, well, then at the end of life, right as your physical abilities disappear, your spirit is ready to not need your physical abilities. You can completely move on. You've got to be ready at death to not be a human anymore. Of course, we don't have it. We don't know when that deadline is, so you better get started now. Hmm. Right? I'm a stoke, brother. I love you, sir. Love you, brother. Hmm.